why yes i am squatting by a tree eating corn i did not want to go out but my friend was like it's your last night i don't know when i'm gonna see you again i was like i <laughs> but anyways i'm waiting for my bike and then i'll see y'all y'all so i am back on kawasan's link with my friend okay i'm happy she pulled me out the house sometimes when i'm ready to go out i'm ready to be out and when i'm ready to isolate and stay inside i'll be staying inside for a minute but i'm so happy she convinced me there's soy cowboy i did not really delve into that on this trip anyways that being said you can feel free to do your own research and go to whatever shows be careful don't get scammed anyways we are on our way to a place called sing sing I'm usually pretty stingy with the free shout outs I learned as a content creator. Those are your wild cards and a lot of people don't like to name drop or whatever it is because they're like, listen, you can get paid for that. But for me, if an experience treats me very well or I feel like it can help out others, I do like to share. And this club, Sing Sing, was a vibe. Free entry, three free drinks for ladies on Thursdays, I believe, at least the time of this vlog when I went. And that was it. It was a free vibe, like, yo. The aesthetic was sensual, enticing, spicy. Like, look, like you had performance up there in, like, vintage-looking outfits. You had the lanterns and the lights and all of it. People was vibing. The music was... I guess, shall I say Western, Ice Spice was playing in the club, okay? So take that as you will. And it was just really nice. It was crowded. It was hot. I need to keep bringing a fan to the club because your girl can sweat. Because your girl was a dripping and a dropping. I met a friend of my friend. She was absolutely amazing. People were swinging from the ceiling. We also ended up at Kawasan for the end of the night because I think Sing Sing closed at a certain hour. And so we kept our party on and we went to this one bar that's super trippy. Met some cool people, but you know, everybody seems to get along when they drunk anyways and yeah after that i headed back y'all know that audio and seated can you hear me hold on let me check y'all know that audio and steven universe that goes life is beautiful and he's like choked up crying y'all <sighs> so tonight was a night tonight was a night and it's crazy because i didn't even feel like going out and then my friend was like girl get your ass out here and as soon as i was out here i was like we gotta go out every day <sighs> first off my okay so it's my last night it is currently like 7 in the morning. Right, Hold on, let me check. It's 6.30 in the morning. I just got back. My friend's a real one. I got to start getting SIM cards. My phone was acting up. Grab was not working, downloading none of it. I tried to delete the app. It wouldn't even let me re-download it. She called me and grabbed my hostel real quick. I appreciate that because your girl was literally on the street like, Ugh, and my phone was about to die. Even right now, I got 5% and I'm only vlogging because I know I'm in front of the hostel. Anyways, that being said, so I checked out this morning. I went out last night. It's a Thursday. My friend got to work in an hour and a half. We are not mentally stable. I have a flight today, okay? Like, we went out. Y'all, so we went to this place called Sing Sing. Three free drinks. Ladies got three free drinks, okay, on a Thursday afternoon. Guys was looking pretty cute. Women was looking pretty good. I might have to go inside. I don't know if you can hear me, okay? Everybody was out there looking good, okay? The club was really, really cool. Like, lanterns and a whole bunch of stuff. Girls were swinging on top of the ceilings and stuff. Just different shit. Downtown, downtown maybe? Like, I'm always near Kawasan every time I come here. But downtown is a whole different vibe. So I think next time I come, I'm definitely going to check that out. I don't know. It felt like, yeah, Bangkok's a city, but it felt like this. I don't know. It just felt different. Anyway, so we went to Sing Sing. We was drinking our drinks. We met with my friend's friend. Everybody was cool. We was taking fire pictures. Like, if y'all follow me on IG, all the pictures were fire. We was all looking good. Once again, cheers to genuine female energy. Just like, no, no problem. No, you could just feel it. You could feel it like in the air. Let me not run on my store because I just made space. I'm supposed to go to Vietnam today. Everybody's saying they love Vietnam so much. I'm so glad I'm going. I'm so grateful. But that being said, like, yeah, the energy was just mwah. We got lit. <laughs> you saw girls there with their sugar daddies and some milk shit, okay? Just proudly out there, out and about, like, what? And what about it? Like, it was lit. And then we went to Kawasan. The one friend went home because it was just they had stuff to do the next day. My, me and my other friend, <laughs> we was out there. I got free shoes, y'all. Let me not say that out loud. So I was gifted 
uh, a little trippy trip by somebody who just trips and they're like, yeah, here, take it. Like, <laughs> and I did not keep it. One, because I'm in a foreign country. Two, because I have a flight. You know, I don't, I don't even know. TSA, don't look at me. Your girl's clean. And three, I'm just not really down to like, I'm just not, just not here. Not, no, no. But somebody just dead ass gave me like free whatever. The love was real. I had two people at the same time compliment my dancing. And then somebody else right after. I had multiple people that like, we just love the way you move. And I'm flattered because honestly back home my moves are not that impressive. But I guess by another country standard where people kind of just like jump a lot and like kind of shimmy or whatever. I guess I was moving or whatever. But I got like a lot of compliments on my dancing. Had a girl come up to me. She's like, I don't know where you from, but you spicy. I'm like, trying to get to know me and everything.